started as a dream has become a thriving tortilla business. Gabby Brown has more and three brothers who manufacture authentic Mexican style food products. Love the hairnet. Four hours production, seven days a week. Let me introduce you to Javi and Ricky. Now their dad and uncle started this business in 1982. It started out very small and now it is huge. So behind us, you're looking at all of the masa because they separate the corn area from the flower area for a lot of reasons, which we'll get into in a second. But first, I just want to show you the production. So this is constantly being mixed. Constantly being mixed at all times. We keep on making it, keep on running the tortilla 24-7. Okay, and then as this is coming out, it spits out over here, and it'll run through a big tube, and it goes up in here. Okay, and as that comes out, now you are seeing it being made into the tortillas, the shape of the tortillas. We see the excess. What happens to that excess? The excess keeps on getting reused, so we never have any waste. It just keeps on getting reused. That way we save as much muscle as we can. Now, it might be difficult to see, but there's basically an oven is what it's going through, which will then cook the tortilla, yeah. and it sends it on its way. We showed a little bit earlier the women who were packing them up exactly. because it counts it itself. This is very high tech from probably where it was oh, yeah. when your dads yeah. and uncles started this almost 40 years ago. How has this grown here in Stockton? It has grown drastically. I mean, once we started the business, um, our family just started picking up and kept on building, and their plan was just to provide Stockton and every local area around here with flushy made products, all locally sourced ingredients. So we pride ourselves in continuing this process and hopefully keep on growing and growing. Now they do corn tortilla chips as well. Uh, so kind of a similar process with that. In fact, uh, you might be able to see over here because uh, there's so much going on here. So what happens with the tortilla chips? How do you guys do those? So with the tortilla chips, we first start off with the stone ground corn. As you can see right here, we have that corn that's actually getting stone ground. It's actually coming through the line and we disperse the masa through and it goes through a die cut into the fryer and then it cools down to get salt. Okay, very similar to what they're doing for their tortillas, just on a different scale. Now coming up in the next hour, we're going to the flour side, and I am told that there is nothing better than a flour tortilla right off the line. Mm. And I wish you guys could smell because I'm ready for a quesadilla right now. Yeah. <laughs> it smells <laughs> so good in here. <laughs> I bet. Look at that girl. You know, that's her favorite. It's mesmerizing, isn't right? it? Right? <laughs> Thanks, Gabby. 